<laughs> Headed out to go film my father-in-law Steve on his Minnesota bear hunt. In the last three seasons, Steve has killed three bears at Wheezy Outdoors. We'll see if we can make it four for four. How you guys no. doing? I pulled uh, I, I'm sorry, Steve. <laughs> I pulled the Nate Nelson today. Uh -oh. Got your primers. No, just my backpack. <laughs> so we got uh, Andy's going to pick him up. It's better than a bear ripping it apart. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Had that happen everywhere. How's it going? Going. Good to see ya. Yeah, you too. Ready to sweat? This isn't feeling too bad compared to what I thought it was. That breeze is making a world of a yeah. difference. Yeah, and then the woods in the woods. Or... Oh, when you get in the shade in the woods, it's going to be hot, but I, it's fun. not like last year. Let's see you, man. I figured you took that bag off and just feel it. Caleb. So you keeping Andrew out of trouble here? Yeah. No. No? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> so you guys went to school together then growing up. Is that what happened? Yeah, and we were just a mile down the road from each other, too. Oh. How'd you guys meet? Him and my dad worked together for a few years. Oh. Casey, they just bailed his off. <laughs> yeah. I just get out on work days. <laughs> 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 go pick him up at the Stillwater Penitentiary. <laughs> <laughs> I just pull my thumb out and they're there every time. <laughs> Casey, you're right here. <laughs> we still have no clue what he really did, but we don't talk about that. Anymore. How are you doing? Good, hi. Good to see you. All right, guys, so we're getting started. I'd like to bow our head in a little word of prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this glorious day and this ultimate pastime of hunting. Thank you for helping us keep our heritage going. Of course, we want to pray for success, help the bears come in. But Lord, ultimately, we pray for our safety. Please watch over us and protect us. Thank you, Lord, for everything in your holy name. Amen. 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 <laughs> As you can see, Steve has gotten comfortable with Andrew. <laughs> Like family. Your hunt has a story, and we want to help you share it. For all your big game taxidermy needs, check out Reby's Taxidermy in Barron, Wisconsin. Hey Steve, check out this post. Yeah. Looks like they got a bear down. Mitch got one. Got it with his pistol. Wow. That's super cool.
shot. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, oh Ooh, that's some nice pairs. Who got, wow. the, who got those? Jim Steele got this one. 215 dress, so about 250. Nice. nice. Yeah. Adam's bear. That one is 141 lightweight. Wow, nice. Okay. Nice. Going, Adam. Congrats. Yeah, congratulations, you guys. That looks a little chocolate, doesn't it? It is chocolate. No, it's chocolate. It's chocolate. The other one's got a bee on its chest. Oh, it does? Yeah, yeah. yeah that's the bee on the black one. I knew it was chocolate when it came in because it wasn't black. You know? I'm guessing. Just, you don't want to pass that It's one. definitely big enough. Yeah, I... Temperatures ended up staying really hot the entire week of Steve's hunt. The bears were just not moving in 90 degree weather. Steve kept at it and ended up passing up a younger bear later that week. But in the end, he didn't punch his tag this year. It was a great time being in the Wheezy Bear Camp. We look forward to being there again. <laughs>